So welcome to TWR Facebook Live, all the Cyber Sangha, people who are watching around the world. These uh, live webcasts will be in Tibetan. In Tibetan, I would like to say uh, So today so we have uh, the uh, masters and they come from the non-denominational uh, uh, different religious uh, uh, lineages. And uh, so I welcome all of you. Um, and uh, first of all, I would like uh, to say something and, uh, and give you an introduction. And uh, so we will talk about uh, uh, how we should uh, contact this uh, uh, conversation. And uh, so this, uh, oh, we have an organization called the International Association of uh, Non-Sectarian Tibetan Religious Traditions. And uh, in this uh, association, and uh, we have uh, the representatives from uh, different Tibetan traditions and religious traditions. And uh, this uh, was, uh, uh, organization was established in 2010. Uh, and uh, we have uh, lots of people and uh, who are uh, taking part in this association and working very hard. And uh, so presently, our uh, the president of the association is Jiang Gong and Jiu Mei Wanda Rinpoche. And uh, what the association is about and the mission statement or the uh, the chronology and the Jiang Gong uh, Mei Wanda Rinpoche will uh, say. And uh, now we are in the uh, time of uh, the internet age, uh, so because of technology and uh, we without uh, we, where we are and uh, the time and all uh, the language, and so we can use this technology and the internet uh, and to spread uh, the teachings and uh, uh, messages uh, across of the world, and so. Uh, so we have this opportunity to take the advantage of the technology, talk about the non-sectarianism and its importance. And uh, so uh, the most important thing is uh, everyone is going to talk in, uh, from their point of view and uh, the importance of this meeting and uh, their uh, ideas, perspectives. So now, and uh, when each of us talk about, uh, well, I'm introducing Rinpoche, each speaker, and Jiang Gun and Jiu Mei Wanda Rinpoche is the uh, active uh, uh, president of the uh, Tibetan International Association of uh, uh, Non-Sectarian Tibetan Buddhist uh, Religious Traditions. And the second uh, speaker will be the Kambu uh, Chamba Tempe Rinpoche, and he was the former uh, formal and the president of the association. And the second, third speaker is Yang Jin Rinpoche, and the Yandere Rinpoche, right now we have some technological problems uh, online, and uh, he's trying to join us. Um, when we have some problems uh, at this uh, point, I don't know. If you can see, please raise your hands. Yes, okay, we can see. Uh, thank you. And uh, uh, the fourth is uh, 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 Munjo Rinpoche. Rinpoche, uh, welcome, and I will speak. Thank you for the from the bottom of my heart. Thank you. And the Sogan Rinpoche is in Dharamsala, and uh, he is uh, stay, uh, up there currently. And uh, he is also the. Uh, the, and he's the first, uh, the president of uh, the International Association of uh, uh, Non-Sectarian Tibetan Religious Traditions. And uh, then we have uh, the representatives from the Jonan tradition, Jonan Jiatsai Rinpoche, Chi Jinawa Rinpoche. And Rinpoche, please raise your hand and thank you for joining us. Thank you. And uh, this is uh, the brief uh, introduction to every speaker. So now, now, this is in order to uh, let everybody know who we are, who are the speakers are. Uh, first of all, I would like to ask uh, Jiang Gun uh, uh, and Jimmy Wanda Rinpoche and to speak and talk about the chronologicals of this association and also its uh, purpose or the objectives of the association. Thank you. Thank you, Rinpoche. Okay. Um, 
And uh, today, so uh, so today, I'm going to do this uh, through the from the Facebook and uh, uh, through the uh, the Tibetan uh, the International Association of uh, non sector and Tibetan Religious Tradition. And uh, so the that my spiritual friends and from the different traditions, uh, like from uh, the Nima tradition, Gaju tradition, and the Jonan tradition, and Gelu tradition. And uh, so I have, uh, we have uh, many and uh, great masters uh, f from uh, different traditions, and they are here. And uh, so, and uh, the lamas are uh, uh, so whoever other than the speakers and whoever you are and you're listening and part taking part in this uh, activity, I, I, I greet I, I greet and greet you and welcome you. And now uh, I am uh, the acting the president of uh, the International Association of uh, non sectary Tibetan Religious Traditions. Uh, and uh, uh, this I have been introduced by, as mentioned by Geshe Tenzin Wanjie Rinpoche. And so, as he said, I'm going to uh, say a few words about the objectives or the, the, uh, and the nature of this uh, association. Um, so firstly, I know uh, we had a dissociation in the California in the United States. Uh, uh, the, we have uh, several lamas and teachers you know, who are in uh, living as uh, a uh, station in California. Um, so we gathered together, sort of talked about uh, uh, what shall we do in terms of uh, to uh, the, begin the uh, the movement of an sectarian uh, practice approach. Uh, so the the this uh, association the ideas uh, you know basically come from a Nima uh, tradition and uh, lamas. And uh, so we have uh, the lamas and uh, many lamas in the in and the outside and. Uh, so it's convenient. So therefore, we thought what to sh we should have a, a fund uh, the association or organization. So having said that, uh, as based on this discussion, and we may be, we established this uh, association. And uh, so uh, the, at the beginning, we also thought that this association should not be just a small uh, size, but uh, should be a standard in the more, in the formal. Uh, uh, formally, more uh, uh, they acti have more activities, uh, and uh, so then we thought about uh, how to vote and uh, select uh, the uh, form the uh, the organization, the body members. So when then we. Oh. They we also talked about uh, the how to pick up uh, or select the, the uh, head of the organization or the president. And, and, uh, so we then we do election, and uh, so through the election we uh, established this association, and then. And so then after that, we did the first, the second, the third, and the fourth. Now it's the fourth, uh, the, uh, the president, uh, presidency or the uh, uh, election we did. So from the 2010, from now, and uh, to, till the now, the new year 2018, and um, uh, uh, so we have done in the last uh, eight years. I have uh, and practiced uh, did a lot of good things. Um, uh, we also have uh, the sub uh, the association or subdivision and in India, and we do have uh, the uh, this the association the subdivision and uh, uh, in through the WeChat or the. Um, uh, the online and uh, organization uh, group, and uh, so yeah, we have uh, they talked about uh, the discussion in this meeting or uh, the group of the meetings. So we talk about the history and the background and the philosophical views and uh, the uh, unique uh, characters of each tradition. And so we did a, uh, a lot of things like this. Uh, the, 
And uh, so this, of course, uh, the, uh, the the like His Holiness Dalai Lama, and uh, uh, he supported uh, a great uh, Lee, and um, and uh, so do other many many lamas, and uh, they did uh, the directly indirectly and uh, show their uh, support and uh, rejoice uh, the activities so we have uh, done in, through this uh, association. And uh, so, the, the for example, the His Holiness the Dalai Lama and uh, and uh, uh, and other many lamas uh, who have uh, sent the messages or the congratulations letters and, and uh, to support and show their uh, as, uh, the support to this association and the success of this association. And uh, so, of course, uh, the the main key uh, the mission is uh, the unification or to reach the sense of unity and uh, the fr establish friendship. Uh, and uh, so this is uh, uh, they, uh, because of this, and uh, we have been received a uh, lot of benefits, and uh, has been a great uh, 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 help and uh, success and helpful. Uh, and uh, so the, uh, we also they, uh, went to the associations, members associations also went to different uh, Dharma centers uh, and uh, so had the discussions. And also, for example, in 2018 and uh, in uh, Bodhigaya, and uh, so we also had uh, uh, the uh, uh, invite lots of uh, lamas uh, different uh, from different traditions. So we had a, a sim similar conversation and discussions about uh, non sectarianism and uh, its importance, and it has been very uh, uh, successful. And uh, so th this. Uh, 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 you know, so we have been done this, and uh, the, everyone who participated this has done a great job, and they're very active, and uh, and, and uh, we done uh, so it has been very uh, uh, successful. And, and uh, so through this way, we believe that uh, the uh, this activities act objective is to and uh, uh, to uh, the uh, preserve Tibetan tradition and. Uh, and uh, uh, and to uh, uh, share with the others uh, and through the internet and uh, let everyone know about uh, uh, the uh, the spiritual qualities of this tradition and all the Tibetan traditions and uh, so our conversations of course uh, everyone know that how important these kind of conversations are um, so and uh, and also not just depend on internet but also we believe that uh, through the uh, person to person or best uh, on the person to person meeting and uh, base and this also should be uh, uh, helpful and uh, through this all various way and uh, we can uh, in reinforce the uh, purpose uh, and our activities and reach our uh, objectives um, so this will be great and it uh, will be very very helpful uh, so and uh, so uh, and uh, I would uh, you know, so it is hope that uh, the all the religions uh, without a denomination and differences and uh, can and uh, spread and uh, uh, transmit it to all over the world and helping the sentient beings and uh, in, in the context that here particularly in Tibet to, to tradition and uh, we you know, have uh, the unique uh, the, uh, the, the things that are uh, preserved by or through the each uh, different traditions and uh, so each tradition have uh, preserved and uh, established and uh, and uh, um, share their qualities uh, but uh, this is also the what, what's very important is that we have to have a sacred looking or pure vision and have a, the show the great respect to all the re uh, religious traditions and spiritual orders this is really very important now we are in the very difficult uh, important moment in the history and uh, previously and uh, when we talk about uh, the non-sectarianism, and uh, so 
so it, it has been at the beginning very difficult and uh, uh, because non sectarianism practice or idea is uh, uh, it wasn't easy uh, idea but uh, now and uh, because uh, the people are more uh, have more understanding and see and uh, uh, the importance and advantages so uh, and then and the participant uh, patients are and the people pay attention so much better and greater than before and so everyone has its own unique uh, qualities and uh, every tradition and the uh, school of order has their own and uh, a, a unique feature and they all are authentic and uh, um, so they, all, everyone can contribute to something as, uh, and through their own unique way and for example with myself and uh, I am the uh, follower of the uh, in, uh, tradition of Nima uh, and uh, so the, from the, the first day and uh, I had uh, received some uh, the Dharma imprint or the began to in, in co contact with the uh, Dharma and uh, so so I learned a lot of things and uh, from the beginning and uh, I hold the idea that uh, every uh, Dharma or the tradition and uh, been and, uh, carried out by a different group uh, and uh, it's a uh, pure Dharma it's a uh, very uh, uh, important so I have the I hold this and then uh, uh, this sacred outlooking and um, so um, uh, I have this view but I also practice myself and uh, uh, so then from my own experience that if we everyone hold this uh, outlook uh, sacred outlook in or the pure vision and uh, regard others uh, and uh, their uh, tradition and they will be uh, uh, really uh, very beneficial and uh, so of course uh, that's uh, everyone and uh, and uh, the even just so we have uh, this uh, conversation like at the language level or the verbal level and uh, I think that uh, will build up uh, a very uh, good understanding and uh, it's, a, it's a very uh, nice thing to do and uh, so the, the all the lamas and the eminent masters and the learned great scholars and uh, so we do have all this uh, greater conditions and the uh, very good resources um, and so we, if we take advantage use them properly and, and then we will benefit uh, the not just uh, the benefits that the Tibetan tradition and or tradition from Tibet but also the can benefit all other uh, the religious traditions across uh, the world and then in this way we can contribute uh, and uh, something and uh, to support uh, the uh, world peace and uh, make a world by uh, peace uh, a world a better place and peaceful place and uh, so and uh, so I thank you for all of you coming and taking parts today uh, thank you for your uh, introduction and you did uh, very clearly and uh, your speech was great and uh, so in general I would like to, to say talk to everyone to tell everyone that uh, this uh, association non-sector association and uh, uh, so we have uh, once a year and uh, every year uh, once uh, every year and then, uh, we're going to do this online and uh, talk about uh, the about uh, every traditions uh, and uh, philosophical view and its ritual uh, uh, structures and its uh, background histories and so on and so forth and uh, so I would like to uh, have this uh, in the future every uh, whenever we have time we will do it and uh, I would love to encourage and uh, uh, request you all come and take a, a part in, uh, in the future yeah. secondly we will ask the Kamba uh, and to talk uh, about uh, the hit and the share uh, his idea his view and uh, so and then uh, after the combo chamber uh, then we're going to uh, uh, so we're going to talk uh, more about uh, you know the general idea of uh, religious harmony and religious uh, uh, denominational uh, practice and also talk about uh, the uh, your individuals uh, experience and or view 
And I would like to encourage you to um, talk very openly and freely. And, uh, and uh, please finish with your conversation within seven minutes or a little bit more. And today here, and uh, through the internet, uh, and uh, so in the end of the, uh, the uh, supervision of Tendo Wanji Rinpoche, and uh, we are uh, we're going to talk. Uh, uh, so we're going to have uh, the f f uh, spiritual masters who are very well known and trained and has great knowledge about uh, Buddha's mind and uh, speech and body. <coughs> And uh, they are here, and uh, so I'm very happy um, to be with you all. And uh, now I'm in Seattle, Washington, Seattle, in the U.S. And uh, first of all, and uh, I have done and uh, service to, uh, provide, provide service for a few years in uh, the uh, uh, International uh, uh, Association of uh, Non-Sectarian of Tibetan Religious Tradition. And uh, so, I, and uh, through my uh, service, I have learned and uh, and did a lot of things, and that's quite a success uh, for and a very satisfactory. Uh, and uh, the, so, and uh, first of all, like the and the, the, like my my stories uh, of personal history, and uh, personally, and uh, from my own experience, and. Uh, so the religious harmony, and uh, uh, it's uh, really very important. Uh, I think, uh, you know, first of all, we have to, when we talk about religious uh, harmony and uh, sectarianism, we have to think about uh, the, and the, uh, the very compassionate Buddha, Lord Buddha, and what he has done, you know, and uh, so, and uh, we know that uh, the, the, the masters and in the past, uh, so they have studied the, the body, speech, mind of the Buddha, and uh, um, and uh, so the in, uh, the, the in Tibet, like Jian Jiang Gun Chichi Lu Zhe and he is uh, the uh, the practitioner or so the uh, advocator of uh, the uh, non-sectarian approach, and uh, he not only studied his own tradition, but uh, he studied the, the, uh, the transmissions uh, and uh, empowerment and uh, instructions from all the other four uh, Buddhist traditions, and uh, he. Uh, he uh, did this uh, very through the very open and wide range uh, of approach. And uh, so he has been um, a mentor and uh, set up a perfect example. And I think we should uh, uh, preserve uh, the, his legacy and uh, continue and his uh, uh, spiritual uh, the, uh, legacy which he left. And uh, so, uh, and uh, for example, the secondly, like uh, that, we have the mentor of His Holiness the uh, 14th Dalai Lama. You know, when they, he's not only the you know showed example as uh, within the context of Buddhism itself or Tibetan tradition itself, but uh, you know all the uh, religious world uh, religions across of the world. And he you know and they approached them and promoted the religious harmony, and uh, so and set uh, set up the friendship and uh, and, so, and he's he really did and showed us what uh, what to do and uh, uh, and uh, so here like uh, and uh, we do also have uh, the, in my the place where I live, uh, you know, have the lamas, and uh, they also practice uh, the non-sectarianism, uh, sectarian approach, and uh, uh, so they are not only just a speech and talking and in, uh, at the uh, uh, verbal level, but uh, they are practicing and they're really physically engaging. And another example, like Geshe Denzo Wanjie you know, and through the internet, uh, through the activities such just like this one and uh, so to reach out and uh, so and, uh, he is a great example and this is like uh, the first uh, thing I would want to say. Second thing I would like to say is uh, that uh, non-secretarianism and, uh, uh, and, uh, and uh, is the importance of the practice is because uh, the, the, all the lamas uh, and then and the, the way they to do it is because they go you know, reach out and uh, to approach other lamas and uh, lamas uh, the spiritual teachers from different traditions and asking for teachings and instructions and receiving the empowerment and uh, and uh, so we need to do this and, be, and also we have to because uh, like uh, for example the Buddha and Shakyamuni 
you know, the essence of Buddha's such a compa teaching is compassion. So, the, the, and the, the, comp the very this, the, this uh, teaching and, uh, of uh, compassion, it tells us that we have uh, the reason and we have to approach out uh, and reach out uh, um, and uh, learn the great things from others. And uh, so, and uh, then uh, the first we have to learn, right? And then after we learn it, uh, then we should uh, try to uh, apply it into our day-to-day -day life and then see how it uh, uh, works. So, and uh, of course, then we will gain practice give us our conviction and then, then we will see the quality and we will appreciate it. And then we will make it a trans, uh, the, uh, the ch uh, transformation or we will change our attitude. And then, then of course, we'll build uh, the faith and the trust. And, uh, and so then we can have this uh, religious uh, harmony and uh, non sectarian or non denominationalism uh, can be uh, uh, approached, uh, can be uh, uh, possible. And uh, so, therefore, uh, so. So today, you know, we can through the internet uh, and uh, or various ways uh, to learn uh, others uh, or uh, uh, to express our interests uh, and uh, and from others um, and the learning from them. So and we can approach it to not just from Buddha's uh, him, his own teaching and tradition, and but uh, also the religions traditions for others. And uh, so look back to the Buddhism, you know, the, uh, the Buddha talked about uh, the path and. Uh, uh, results uh, and the views. Uh, uh, all these are uh, when you looking from the uh, essential point of view, and uh, it's about uh, the compassion. And uh, so, so you can't really separate them. And uh, for example, you know the greater body of water we call the ocean, but the ocean is coming from the one source, the, from the river, the from saucer. So whichever the river and the, uh, uh, the stream you do, but uh, everything is uh, eventually leading in the, uh, uh, and in the uh, greater water, the ocean. And uh, so when you're uh, asking for a request, uh, the uh, in, uh, quintessential instructions and uh, the, uh, the traditions, uh, unique uh, teachings, and uh, you will benefit yourself, uh, and you will open your mind, you will become more knowledgeable, uh, and uh, you will see how uh, uh, beneficial, how great uh, it is. And uh, so you will, then you will see uh, that uh, it's the, the, the negativity has been a narrow mind or focus on one single lineage and uh, so so I this is what I did and uh, I would like to thank you very much from the bottom of my heart and I would like to request you please to do the same thing and uh, please uh, and uh, preserving and uh, continue this kind of great activities. Thank you very much, and uh, thank you for your, this great speech. Uh, Yandere Rinpoche is from India. The internet connection seems a, bit, a little bit difficult. Uh, we hope that uh, the, there's no interruptions for Rinpoche's speech. Yandere Rinpoche, please speak. Speak. Um, the uh, do you hear me? Okay. Okay. Uh, so I'd like to say thank you and greetings to you all. And, and uh, today through the internet or online. And, uh, and, and I, I appreciate it. Thank you for uh, the organizer of uh, today's uh, conference and a webinar. And so now uh, uh, we talk about uh, the non sectarianism and we talk about religious harmony. Uh, so this is our topic. Uh, so in general, and the non-sectarianism, uh, so the harmony is the uh, foundation of uh, everything. And uh, so when you have the harmony, and uh, whether you do in the worldly activities or religious practice, uh, and uh, the or the from the uh, secular so community to the spiritual and the community, everything will be 
the uh, be uh, very uh, productive and uh, uh, will be uh, uh, so successful. So there will be uh, has the greater benefits. So therefore, the uh, the harmony and the religious harmony and uh, uh, harmony is the key, is the base. And uh, but then how to cope with it because if you have the sense or strong belief in the harmony and then you will not have the sectarianism uh, or pre prestigious and uh, uh, religious prestigious against someone and uh, so I think there's two things we have to know first of all uh, the religious non-sectarianism is uh, uh, in general in the world you know we have many religions in, in the uh, internationally um, um, but uh, at the, in, in particular in, in Tibet uh, we have uh, the uh, many religious traditions and uh, so we uh, so we have to think about uh, either from an international uh, point of view or from uh, the local, like a Tibetan point of view, a religious point of view, and a locally exam or internal exam. We have to see what caused the, the religious disharmony or religious uh, uh, sectarian uh, and the religion instead of a non-sectarian but the secular term. The causes and the conditions, and uh, we have to examine them and find out, and then and uh, cope with that uh, very cause of the problem. And secondly, and uh, so the way to overcome this problem is uh, we have to emphasize that we all uh, follow the one and uh, master, uh, the founder, and. Uh, so, because uh, we are all for one teacher, and uh, one teacher only uh, teaches one thing, and uh, uh, so, so therefore, the, so when we talk about the, uh, the religious lineage, and uh, there's a lineage is uh, come from uh, one base and from one roots, and uh, so one foundation and uh, one origin, and uh, in the context of Tibet, uh, uh, so, so we have uh, this. Uh, and uh, we have so the Buddha from Buddha and uh, and then, then from Buddha and Shakyamuni all the way to uh, uh, Guru Rinpoche and Bama Sambawa and uh, then transmitted to Tibet and uh, so the, uh, we have four traditions Tibet and uh, and uh, like Nalinda is the, uh, has been a great uh, uh, the uh, center of learning. And whatever the lineage uh, we uh, we are hold uh, we are preserving or uh, we consider is the most important, but all of them are. And the, when you think about the origin, their origin, they come from India. So all of them are transmitted or uh, been introduced uh, 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 the, from uh, India. So its origin is uh, again goes to back to its roots in India. And all the lamas actually they have uh, the uh, strong spiritual connections, and uh, all the way to Buddha. So therefore, and uh, every single Tibetan tradition goes back uh, all the to way to the uh, Buddha, and, and uh, so it's like the water, you know, and the uh, other way it goes to back to its origin, and this is the fact. Uh, so no, we we are practicing, we are talking and uh, thinking about religious non-denominationalism, and so we explain it and uh, we and try to uh, understand and, uh, um, but uh, fundamentally, uh, so the, the, the within the uh, different schools of uh, 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 religious tradition. And uh, so the the learned masters and then uh, uh, the the head of uh, the leading figures and people, uh, and, uh, and, uh, and uh, they they have to know that uh, you know and uh, how they explain and uh, how they uh, uh, they interpret the the uh, discourse or the uh, uh, treatises. And then, so they, their interpretation as uh, carries a, a unique flower and a unique and a unique uh, uh, character, and uh, because of the unique interpretation, and and uh, so and uh, the it is uh, different, uh, but uh, fundamentally has to be essentially has to be agreeable, has to be the something that's uh, uh, no contradictory. 
And uh, so if uh, explanation at the beginning and uh, if it's, uh, uh, have a different flavor helps a lot, but uh, if you emphasize and do, uh, the, the difference but do not make uh, the uh, context, put it in the context and uh, make it as a whole, as a, uh, the, uh, it's not cont contradictory free, then will be uh, uh, problematic. So therefore, they, when we think about uh, the uniqueness of the uh, one's lineage and uh, one's uh, uh, tradition, and uh, then we have to be careful and think about it and, and put it in context. And uh, in, 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 in Tibetan and uh, tradition, and uh, we have all the Tibetan and uh, the, the, so the four traditions, or all, all Tibetan traditions, uh, and uh, so, and so now we are mainly focused on Tibetan traditions. Uh, so within this context, and uh, we all are followers of uh, the Mahayana tradition, and uh, we all are the practitioners of Bodhicitta. And uh, so, therefore, uh, the, like uh, the previous speakers said, uh, and uh, essentially we all practice, uh, we practice the uh, Dharma, and uh, we started from with the take a refuge, uh, taking how to take a refuge, uh, uh, generate the refuge mind. And uh, so the refuge mind or the practice of the uh, uh, taking refuge is the foundation. Uh, and uh, so then we have the renunci practice of renunciation, and, uh, and then of course bodhicitta. And, uh, and uh, the, all of them goes back to the uh, foundation, fun, fundamental teaching of the idea of uh, great compassion. And so when you really understand, stick on to the idea of a great compassion, you can't really see something is concrete or solid over there. It can be separated or uh, and uh, considered as uh, uh, others. No. And, uh, so even if you see this a relative in a relative sense, and but you will take it as, as uh, something as uh, to instead of a separation, rather you uh, you, you see this as a greater thing to unify or to enrich the uh, uh, helping each other, uh, and. Uh, so the, 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 the philosophical view and is, it requires the, uh, invest, uh, the critical investigation. And uh, so it's a, it's a difference because of uh, the uh, different capacities of uh, intellect, intelligence. And uh, so the, the, the interpretation would be different, right? But if you know that uh, the uh, foundations of the teaching or the purpose of the, the practice is compassion, then you want to have a find a greater reason or solid reason and, and to uh, uh, make yourself or others be considered a, a separate thing. Uh, so if we think of all this uh, and together, and uh, we can't really make a separation, and uh, so we will see the as instead of uh, see the individual practice, we will see this whole thing as as whole. We are the one, and uh, this way we will get uh, the our goal and achieve our goal. That is uh, non-sectarianism or uh, impartiality. Thank you very much. This is the two points I want to say. Uh, thank you, and uh, I thank you, Yang Dian Rinpoche. Now, I would like to ask uh, the Yang Dian Rinpoche to uh, say uh, something, a few words. And uh, so, so I would like to remind you of your uh, and uh, so I would like to say uh, please uh, introduce, uh, yourself, uh, a uh, please introduce uh, yourself a little bit. I mean, most uh, people, the, the uh, listeners uh, or others, will know who you are. And uh, but uh, first of all, and uh, regardless what, and just to say a few words about who you are, your background, your tradition, and uh, and your own practice, and your feelings towards the non-sectarianism approach. Uh, and, uh, and uh, think about uh, the listeners and think about the, how your speech is going to affect the society as a whole or in, in, in large. And uh, so please uh, remember and, and, and uh, keep this uh, point in mind. And, and uh, hello, how are you? And so t t today and uh, here we have uh, the great eminent masters and uh, all we are here. And uh, I'm glad to be here. And uh, 
So myself is very happy to have this opportunity. I thank you for the opportunity. Uh, and my name is Menjo. Uh, uh, and so uh, my tradition is Gaju, Gaju tradition, Gaju order. And uh, myself uh, uh, personally, and uh, I, I I appreciate the idea of the uh, and also practice the non-sectarian approach. Uh, I myself personally. Um, so I stick on this idea, and this is my uh, uh, use as the foundation, and uh, and uh, so I from this uh, as a base and the idea, then I uh, study the uh, scriptures and I go up outside and approach others and uh, to help the communities. And uh, so today in the, in the world, we have all kinds of religions in the world. So when I go and uh, so and, uh, I believe that uh, so if we approach uh, everyone and from a non-secretarian point of view and uh, we will make the uh, religions uh, of the world and the harmony and uh, uh, respect each other. And through this way, we can and, uh, uh, provide the services and uh, help in the society and make it uh, the world more peaceful, a better place, and uh, we will be unified rather than separated. And uh, this is, uh, we will take, a, ha this has a great advantages and uh, it will be uh, very benefits. So, so I think that we all have to make effort. I see this as a great importance. And uh, so I, um, as I said, I am a follower of Gaju Oda. And in Gaju Oda, we have uh, the unique view, unique practice and unique uh, uh, history. And if you understand this, of course, it will be really very, very beneficial, helpful. Yeah. And uh, like, uh, you know, the great master, Siddhar Rinpoche, and Siddhar Rinpoche is uh, approaching the uh, non-sectarian uh, and uh, uh, practice. And, uh, and, uh, and uh, Rinpoche also is the one who emphasized the importance of uh, non-denominationalism. And... Uh, so, and, uh, so I personally find so. Uh, the, uh, so, the, if you study, uh, just approach others, and uh, there are some concerns. Say, uh, would you uh, lost your own uh, uh, individuality or in characters of individual tradition? Uh, you maybe have uh, will have this concern probably. Uh, but uh, if you actually, if you overcome this fear and you go out, approach and asking the teaching and uh, make connections. And you will see that other traditions, they have uh, the very unique uh, attributes uh, uh, in terms of uh, their philosophical view and uh, their ritualistic practice uh, and uh, their histories. And uh, then, then you see not only the others uh, uh, quality, but uh, you will build up uh, confidence in your own tradition. You find, oh, you, now you see both. And uh, so you, you will really respect uh, and your uh, others, but uh, will uh, love your own tradition more. And, uh, so, so therefore, I myself, from the very beginning, from think about the Buddha's uh, teaching, and then through my own experiences, and uh, take others' uh, follows and uh, others uh, model set, set up for, and uh, so then I did a great benefit. I did uh, received a lot of benefits, and uh, so when I'm thinking, uh, so so when we talk about uh, the. Uh, the agreeable, something agreeable, and a lot of things we can agreeable, and the things, the, the plenty, uh, eminent, uh, the uh, numerous things we can agree upon, but uh, there are also something that is uh, disagreeable or, or is unique, and uh, so so the, the everyone has its own unique uh, feature, a unique quality or character, and uh, like Jonas, uh, Nimus, and uh, Agilus, you know. Uh, this is like, uh, you know, the, uh, uh, use the analogy as a disease, you know. If you have a disease, you have to have different uh, medicine and to treat the, the, uh, the, uh, that very illness. So different medicine would work in uh, functions differently and uh, all of them will be helpful. And also, like uh, the business today, you know, and uh, today we are business-wide, uh, economically uh, speaking, we are so developed uh, and it's because uh, the, we are cooperate and uh, cooperations and uh, the friendships and uh, 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 together uh, uh, the working and uh, working together so we developed 
So similarly, and in the religious context, if we do and uh, approach the religion from the appreciation point of view, from the pure uh, or sacred looking and outlook point of view, and we will and also uh, reach the uh, solidarity and the uh, harmonies. Mm. And uh, again, like an example, that could take the disease of the uh, under the medicine analogy. So each religion, like medicine, they have its own unique uh, uh, features and the uh, efficacy. And so if you use different tradition and to cope with the unique situation, that will be really helpful. So therefore, and um, like uh, my hands, uh, if you want to take something with the hands, uh, 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 so if you uh, hold the five fingers together you hold like a 30 pound or more and the, the things are weight more so if you have few five fingers together and then you try to lift up you can do it right and uh, so because it has the uh, verse and the, the channels and the annals and every finger has its own uh, power and on uh, 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 the strength so same thing so in and the world and the, we, uh, if we unify and uh, consider the importance understand the importance of others and the values of others and uh, especially in today's context like uh, for instance like uh, four people and uh, we have four people we will do a uh, one project and uh, each individual contribute uh, uh, their own and uh, uh, make their own effort from the outside and uh, the, each of them will contribute something and uh, bring their unique uniqueness and uh, uh, unique qualities and then and, and then, then they produce the very beneficial uh, uh, result and uh, of course, uh, then, and here, you know, when we talk about uh, the religious non-denominationalism, we we'll, would we'll, and learn the uh, things from other, and through this way, we will uh, enhance or uh, enrich our own philosophical view and the ritualistic structure and the practices. And, uh, and uh, so, and uh, in general, in Tibet. Uh, we, in Tibet, we do have the secretarial, uh, non-secretarianism, and the, 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 or uh, generally uh, is uh, being harmonious. Um, but uh, and, uh, and and so, uh, but uh, the, we, we have to uh, reinforce this, and uh, so we'll think about others' benefits and how to benefit others. And uh, so I would just say, so you, we must just hold and the, the idea of a sacred outlook in very dearly and in our heart. And uh, this way we can help others. And uh, thank you very much. This is my brief uh, uh, talk. Uh, can you hear me now? Uh, oh, okay. So thank you, Manjir Rinpoche. Thank you. Uh, and uh, next, uh, we're going to have uh, uh, we're going to have uh, the uh, the former uh, president of uh, the association, Zogen Rinpoche. And uh, uh, so, whoever here, and uh, to all those who are here and uh, online today with the uh, 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 with me, and. Uh, no, we're going to have uh, the live uh, through the Facebook, and uh, so there are many people and uh, listening to in this uh, conversation and uh, participating. I thank you very much uh, for all you uh, coming to this conversation, and I uh, thank you, Kishi Wan Jianrenbuche, to organize uh, this event, and. Um, so we established uh, this International Association of uh, Non-Sectarian Tibetan Religious Tradition for about eight years. And uh, so we formed this in California. And uh, so since then, we uh, hold uh, lots of uh, conferences like this one and the discussions. Uh, and uh, so the, like this one we have uh, done before, and uh, so it has been uh, active uh, so far. And uh, so and, uh, before we had uh, in, the, in the meeting in person, and but uh, today now here, we're going to take advantage of uh, uh, modern technology and uh, can hold this uh, uh, conference. And uh, uh, so have everyone from different parts of the world and get together and discuss and uh, to benefit uh, many other people. And that's what I'm thinking, I believe. 
So now when we talk about uh, the religious non-denominationalism, and uh, and uh, and so for example, and uh, I, my name is uh, Sogan Rinpoche. I come from Nima tradition, uh -huh. and so I was born and grew up in Tibet. So the, I went to Tibet, uh, India, and uh, so then I come from India, come to United States, uh, or the, the uh, India, and uh, I'm in uh, Dharamsala now. Mm. And uh, so when we first go and uh, forming this, so establish this uh, association, and uh, I had a strong faith and a belief and. Uh, uh, in religious uh, uh, non-denominationalism or non-sectarianism, sectarian approach, and uh, so uh, the previously before the uh, and, uh, and the lots of people and lots of great speakers and uh, said uh, wonderful and uh, made a wonderful remarks a speech, and uh, I don't have uh, something to add up or say something new, um, but. And my own uh, Lama and my own teacher, a Guru Guru, who is the one and uh, uh, and uh, has a great faith in non-denominationalism, um, impartialism, uh, impartiality, and so therefore, under his influence from the very beginning of my training and study, and he always emphasized the importance of. Uh, um, the respect, uh, show respect for, uh, have a respect for uh, others. Because of this, and uh, I have a deep faith and I have a deep, uh, pure vision in my heart and um, uh, toward others. I appreciate uh, this uh, tradition. So now, and so today, in the, in the context of Tibet, we have uh, five different uh, traditions, and of course. Uh, and uh, including bone, and then we have six uh, different traditions. Um, so within this, and uh, so we have a, uh, and uh, the, so the 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 uh, yeah without five uh, the traditions, uh, including bone tradition, and uh, we 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 all are, uh, and uh, so from Tibetan historical point of view, and. Uh, so in the past, uh, we do had uh, uh, religious uh, uh, conflicts uh, and or religious uh, uh, divisions and uh, sectarianism. And uh, so it has been a troublesome in the history. But now in the new generation, uh, we are here today and in this new age. And uh, so we uh, have to uh, approach something completely new and uh, try to move in forward and uh, uh, merge to a new pages of the history and uh, to uh, overcome the uh, sectarianism problems with sectarianism, but uh, uh, and uh, create the, or develop the religious harmonies and, and through the now sectarianism no, approach. Um, so. And uh, my experience is, uh, uh, when I was in the West, and uh, so the, the, the Tibetan Buddhism, uh, Tibetan traditions are quite uh, 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 well known in the West. And uh, but when we think about uh, Tibet uh, tradition, and uh, we have to know that uh, all these traditions are actually back to the three eminent uh, masters of Bhamasabha, Shantara, and uh, Guru Rinpoche, right? Uh, and uh, but uh, although all this come from the same roots, uh, and some Dharma centers, and uh, others or uh, and. Uh, and uh, so those who uh, have no ideas about religion or not interested in religion, when they're looking outside and uh, from uh, uh, certain behaviors of the uh, people who in the uh, uh, teacher uh, the, in the, the Tibet tradition, they might be find that so uh, we doing something like uh, very contradictory, or we doing the things uh, like we do almost like the uh, fire and water, you know, and completely uh, uh, maturely exclusive. But that's of course a misunderstanding. 
And uh, so upon seeing this kind of a thing uh, concerns me, and I thought that will not be good. Uh, and so then and uh, I have uh, come to the West, and uh, no, the, the, so no, the, we have uh, the relationship is, uh, or contact is uh, kind of that, no much as uh, it used to be. Uh, so then, of course, the less contacts, the less uh, uh, relation, and uh, then there's uh, you know harder to uh, form a friendship. Uh, right. So then I thought about uh, we should uh, get together and keep a contact, make a, a, a connection, and this way, and uh, we can develop uh, the trust and respect uh, and the religious harmony. And then, of course, this through this way, we can serve the uh, communities and the world as in large and. Uh, so uh, we don't have much time, so I don't want to talk more. And uh, but uh, the important thing is that, the, that we have to remember the great advantage of uh, the religious non-sectarianism, and um, it is uh, ha it has great advantages and benefits. And, uh, and so, uh, in general, of course, they're going to benefit the world, and uh, but in particular, we're going to benefit Tibet, and uh, in particular. And uh, so that's what I believe. So probably this is what I'm saying. And uh, so everyone, and I will request you in the future, please continue doing the great things which you have done. And uh, so we ever, we're going to have this kind of meeting every uh, once a year, every year. And. Uh, And uh, we're going to, uh, yeah, we have the, the Boston and the, the, the Galuba tradition and the center there. We're going to also have the form of those me meetings like this. And uh, so I wish uh, may all be uh, happy and uh, uh, endure with the causes of happiness. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Rinpoche. And uh, you said uh, uh, great remarks. And uh, uh, the bottom of my heart, I thank you very much. And uh, so, so Jeremy, I would like to say thank you. A special thank you is because, and you, and uh, so you are the one the, from the uh, you are the one who uh, founded and uh, started. Um, so, and uh, then w we had uh, the Kambo Wood uh, was uh, the uh, vice president, uh, and. Uh, Lama Lama Chenle Wujie was uh, the treasure and uh, others uh, who, uh, because of uh, their uh, effort, and uh, we had this opportunity, um, and uh, uh, we have this form uh, of situation now, and it has been many years, and it's uh, uh, doing so well so far, and um, and thank you again, and uh, lastly, uh, next we would like I request that the. Uh, represent from Jonan tradition and Chichen uh, Nawa Rinpoche. So please, uh, Rinpoche. Okay. Uh, um, uh, and so the, all the, the representatives from the Tibet tradition and uh, the all five traditions, including the Bumbu tradition, uh, and uh, the particularly here, and uh, the, the, the participation or the organizers of this uh, uh, webinar and the, those who are listening to this conference. Uh, and uh, thank you very much for all your uh, effort. And so first of all, and uh, you said uh, I would like to introduce myself. And so I was uh, the combo and I was also the uh, MB and uh, uh, so my tradition is a Jonan tradition, uh, and, and uh, so and I have uh, been I had a wonderful and a fortunate opportunity. Fortunately, have a great opportunities learned uh, the so the uh, the le le learned and listened to His Holiness Dalai teaching, and uh, His Holiness uh, and uh, gave uh, the great press. Great press and wrote a prayer for the Jonan lineage, and uh, so highlighted the uniqueness of the Jonan tradition, um, and uh, so which was very encouraging. And now, so now here we talk about religious harmony and a non-denominational approach. And, uh, so we all are actually are the followers of the one teacher, 
and uh, Shakamuni and uh, 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 and uh, the, the the master Shinra is uh, a little bit exception, but uh, the other than that, we all are uh, the, from the same uh, from same roots. So the the focus and the goal the same. That is uh, to benefit all sentient beings and uh, to uh, uh, the reduce sufferings of all sentient beings. And uh, because uh, the Buddha taught the, his teaching is for the benefit of uh, others and his followers uh, to spread or to preserve this very uh, his teaching again for the same purpose. And uh, so therefore, this uh, throughout the history. And um, and so the way we kind of at the management level sometimes uh, is, uh, there are differences and even there are contradictions there. And uh, but if we all hold uh, the sacred outlook or the pure vision and uh, show the great respect to others, and uh, so we would uh, uh, reach our goal. That's the religious harmony, and the religious harmony is absolutely extremely important, and. Uh, so, and if, if, for example, with the uh, Jonan tradition, and uh, the tradition of Jonan, uh, and uh, so the, the, uh, the teachers and uh, uh, masters uh, who uh, have many of them approach the non sectarian approach, Gunga uh, Zhongcho and the Master Gunga Zhongcho, for example, and uh, that's one of the very m m most precious Lama. And uh, at uh, the in the back to history at his time, and uh, he approached the traditions uh, of uh, lamas from the Nima tradition, and uh, requested teachings, uh, and uh, and he actually and uh, received teaching from uh, 108 different uh, teachers, teachings from 108 different uh, masters, uh, and uh, so he also approached the uh, from a Kaju traditions and uh, learned from the Kaju masters. And then we have uh, the master of Gela Jianzhou, the master of Gela Jianzhou from Jilong tradition. Uh, he also and uh, uh, they practiced non-sectarianism and all approach. And uh, he went uh, and uh, reached out and uh, uh, many different traditions. And uh, in, in his uh, one of his prayer, and he made a prayer that uh, may all the religions without uh, uh, denominational difference and without any uh, th uh, theoretical differences so may all be uh, prosperity and uh, uh, growth growing. So he made that prayer, and he also and uh, actually himself did and follow that very prayer. And uh, so we, and uh, as uh, uh, the follower, and uh, um, so uh, we all are doing, should be doing this. Uh, and uh, so, you know, the, it is a great, uh, you know, we learn us from others, and uh, and uh, we get a very uh, great experts, and. Um, uh, with uh, within ourselves, but uh, at the same time, if we approach others, learn more important, uh, learning others from others, we will make ourselves more rich and uh, more uh, uh, strong. And uh, uh, so, and uh, one of the, the master, uh, that oh, he the uh, the master and uh, actually one of my teacher. And uh, so at some point, and uh, after the conversation, actually I got uh, criticized uh, by this master, and uh, because of my uh, uh, comments on certain thing, and uh, so, and uh, he is uh, strongly emphasized my teacher is about the importance of uh, the have uh, hold the a sacred outlook and uh, have a pure vision about others uh, uh, teachings traditions, so, and uh, I. I remember the, the, his advice, and uh, I do my very best to uh, show my respect to others. And uh, so I have a, the, the, the a strong view and believe in, the, in my mind. And uh, uh, so 
and uh, I also have uh, the so form the the uh, the uh, spiritual uh, relationship uh, and then with other from other traditions or with other masters uh, from different tradition uh, and uh, so in my mind I really don't have a C and there is a, 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 a substantial differences between the each traditions uh, and uh, so after all you know all religions is aimed to benefit the world uh, the, the, the people in the world and uh, so our goal is to uh, help you out, and, uh, and uh, so you know we have the idea of uh, uh, the sacred outlook. And if we really believe this, we know that uh, it doesn't matter who doing what. Maybe they are doing things different. However, they are probably the emanation of Buddha or Bodhisattvas, and so we have to think about this and remember this. And uh, so. Uh, of course, in the obvious level, and uh, you know, uh, we have uh, the, the the people and and, and uh, to, uh, to, uh, from different tradition, and uh, we live with them together. And uh, so I was to remind myself, uh, although they are different, but uh, essentially we are the same. And uh, so after all, the the essential teaching I remembered and uh, used to approach the non-sectarianism is non-violence. So. You know the essence of Buddha's teaching is non-violence and uh, so no harming, harming, harming free. So therefore, they uh, they, they respected others. So I have uh, I always think that the uh, you know the opportunities like this and it will be very beneficial. I believe it and and uh, and uh, so I met lots of other people from different traditions and uh, I participated in different uh, conf uh, conferences and uh, the discussions like this. And uh, so I learned a lot, and I believe, and, uh, and uh, so this is, if we keep going, doing this, uh, we will uh, not only help Tibet traditions uh, in general, and, uh, but uh, we can and, uh, help others, uh, all sentient beings, and, uh, 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 essentially. And because the different people have their different uh, interests or predispositions, and they are different, but uh, if we uh, Focus on the essential point of the Buddhist, uh, the uh, spiritual teaching, and that's that then we can reach this uh, harmony and uh, have a reason to show respect to others, and uh, so well, in, in the context of Tibet, you know, and though we have uh, then, uh, the five traditions and including Bon, and uh, we all uh, so can work together, and we all uh, follow the uh, the great teachings. And uh, so we all can do reach our goal, and uh, so we think uh, together we can find a way, a path to reach our goal. That's uh, my belief, and thank you, and uh, thank you, Rinpoche. Uh, so, Jato Rinpoche, thank you very much. Uh, no, I'd like uh, to say a few words and introduce myself. Uh, and essentially, my name is Denzen Wangje, and uh, so uh, so through the life on Facebook, uh, and uh, and uh, I thought uh, you know if we can do this on life, uh, it would be great. And uh, in general, I doing this uh, through the Facebook uh, and a whole lot of activities have been uh, uh, through the Facebook with the end. So, so I thought that they invited the masters and the eminent teachers from different tradition. So then I organized this. And uh, in general, the uh, born tradition uh, yeah, and, uh, and so it is a native Tibet, Tibetan religion and uh, uh, tradition native tradition to Tibet. And, uh, but my mother, my father actually is a Gelu. He followed the uh, Gelu tradition and he went to Sarah Monastery and he studied. And uh, my mother is a Bon follow, follow Bon tradition. And uh, so from Kam. And uh, I mean, I, I went to Merigomba and received the Geshe degree and studied there. And uh, uh, so, uh, 40, uh, 34th, uh, and uh, mainly Tinzen Rinpoche, uh, and they did, uh, 
And uh, so, yeah, uh, we had this uh, a new uh, throne holder of the journal, uh, the new uh, born tradition, and this is great, uh, very fortunate news, and great thing. And um, so, I would like to uh, share this news with all of you. And uh, so, all the religions in general, like world religion or the Tibet tradition, and all that, uh, and. Uh, yeah, so I myself and I have a great faith and a, and a deep uh, appreciation for others, uh, and uh, so I do this uh, uh, from the formal and mainly Tianjin Rinpoche, the strong holder of the Bun tradition, and uh, my root gurus, uh, and uh, they all uh, teach and uh, uh, and uh, practice the, from different uh, religious traditions, and then they give me a, a strong, strong uh, appreciation. And uh, so, uh, and so with the uh, earlier we talked about uh, the differences of between each tradition and uh, and uh, how to understand it, the differences. And uh, so, from my experiences, like Soga Rinpoche and the Tudan Rinpoche, when we talk, when we have a first meeting, and they sent me uh, the invitation, and uh, after I received the initial invitation, I thought it was a really wonderful opportunity. So I thought uh, I must uh, take it. So before that, I thought even though I believe in the non sectarianism but. Uh, I have no opportunities, and uh, no, I have the aspiration, so I immediately embraced the opportunity. And uh, so then they made us say, you are the second uh, uh, the uh, president, so I have no choice, it seems I did, uh, and so therefore I accepted the, uh, the, uh, the assignment and, and, act, and, and served as a president. And, uh, and so, uh, so then since then I did a lot of things. I, I think I produced some result. Uh, and you may want to know and the soldier Rebuche. We all kind of, uh, you know, inside at the individual personal level, uh, we have a shared teeth and have a meal together. And uh, we so we kind of, uh, you know, and uh, we, we travel together and uh, so, and uh, we always feel so very close, and uh, and uh, we went to Japan, and uh, we met in Japan, uh, so traveled there, and so we're doing this not only just you know the, the at as a theory, but rather we do this as a really and uh, as in the real life, and so this year also have this uh, had this uh, uh, thoughts and um, and motivation that. What if uh, you know we have uh, this uh, have uh, the, the meetings like this uh, and take it as an opportunity to learn from others and pay attention to others and then and uh, if we pay attention and then, then we can learn and uh, from others. So when you pay attention to others, you will know that and uh, uh, the qualities of others. So you will know how they're thinking, what they're thinking, uh, and uh, so and then through that way you will really learn a great uh, and the qualities from others. Others. In general, and uh, so you know, we, we, we would just say, so it is benefits me, so therefore I, I pay attention. If it's not a benefit, we tend to not pay attention, but that's wrong. We should you know, uh, think more broadly, and like Munjuru Mujur said, uh, and we must pay attention because it's different, because they are not sim uh, uh, they are uh, unfamiliar, or they are not the same. So and by paying attention to the, uh, the, with this reason, we can really learn the, their unique qualities. And uh, so anyway, so pay attention and hold the sacred outlook or pure vision is really important because this way we will not focus on our own goal or our own needs, and uh, but rather is as broadly and uh, and uh, the benefits of others, all others. And uh, we will really and uh, pay attention to see, uh, understand how they feel as an individual person. You know what they experience and uh, uh, how they uh, uh, live. And um, um, so, uh, and uh, then we can really and uh, uh, make a close, uh, bring closer and make a French uh, friends. And uh, so, as a practitioner, as a, a spiritual uh, person. And I think this is necessary. We must do it. And uh, like Munjuru Rinpoche, you know, and uh, so uh, make a 
connection with me and also and we made a uh, connection and um, and they were also in there and I have the meal together was good and John and Jatsi Rinpoche we so met in person had a meal together and we talking and so we s uh, formed a very uh, close relationship so I see all these are the foundations of uh, the religious harmony or religious uh, um, uh, understanding uh, so, and uh, so the and uh, so that's what I see how important it is and uh, what I, and, uh, I did. So that's what probably is all I want to say. We don't have much time and it's today and because I'm an organizer and I can't take advantage to uh, misuse the, my, uh, uh, organize, my position. And uh, now we have about 25 minutes and uh, so now the Rinpoche, all you, if you have want to say something and want to say or add up uh, two or three minutes, uh, or if you want to question each other and ask a different uh, Lama questions, and please go ahead. And uh, so I'm like, uh, make the floor open now. Uh, uh, and uh, thank you very much for your speech and it's wonderful and what should I say uh, nowadays in the society um, uh, so uh, we are talking about uh, the the benefits of the non-sectarianism uh -huh. and uh, so in general uh, I think we talk uh, this is better And so, you know, but you, can, would you like to say something about it, in general? Uh, and uh, we religious uh, tradition or spiritual lineages. And then, li like you said, uh, we have to f first pay attention and to others. And uh, so, without uh, really sacrifice one's own system, and the best of one's own system of faith in a de uh, devotion to one's own faith, uh, one's own f system, and then should then uh, reach out and uh, approach others uh, by holding the uh, sacred uh, outlook. Um, and uh, so then we can reach harmony. And uh, harmony is, uh, you know, the kind of show the respect and, uh, and uh, and uh, the uh, uh, love and then others and like uh, in the family member in the, in the context of family so the family members if they show each other and the love and respect and then the uh, families will have a uh, 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 happy in their life similarly and here in the religious context and the religious families and uh, if we show the uh, uh, great respect and love others and it should be and, uh, uh, simple and easy to approach. Uh, 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 I would like to say a few words. Uh, in the meanwhile, please think about it, uh, what you're going to say and uh, what you would like to add up. Uh, uh. And uh, like I said before, uh, so my ideas too is uh, pay attention and uh, uh, the pure vision. So pay attention is uh, you kind of uh, prepare uh, prepare yourself. Yeah, the, the here I have this uh, online webinar is because I paid attention, and you hear all, and uh, because uh, you paid attention. And uh, I think in, uh, right now we have about 312 people. All of them are here is because they pay attention. So therefore, in my view, is the first step is uh, the uh, pay attention. And uh, so uh, pay attention is the first step to reach uh, the harmony and uh, non sectarianism um, Because uh, if you pay attention, then, then 
And uh, so if you pay no attention, you will know that you don't know others. For example, others pay no attention to Bun tradition. They will ask you, say, is Bun has uh, uh, the translation of uh, uh, the uh, scripture? Is they have, do they have uh, the, all the, the volumes of uh, the spiritual and the uh, canon or the uh, treatises? So why do people have this uh, question uh, toward the bumbu or uh, bun tradition? It's because they have uh, they did not pay attention. They have no interest to pay any attention to it, and uh, so therefore, if you pay attention, and then you will begin to develop the sacred look. And uh, yeah, I agree with you, what you said, really. So the uh, pay attention will like open the door and uh, open up everything, and then you can begin to approach and to study. And then you can and, uh, put it into practice. Uh, but as uh, the most important thing, and uh, to practice non-secretarianism, uh, and but generally, I think there's a fear, the sense of deep concern about uh, if you approach others, it seems kind of lose the one's own ground or one's own individuality. It seems that the you sacrifice the your own the sort of uh, uh, the honor or and uh, the sort of uh, lower down yourself. This is actually the wrong. And uh, really, because when you approach the others uh, with respect, and, um, and the, so you have uh, already have your unique uh, qualities, and uh, and uh, the, uh, and uh, the, uh, so, but then you go out and uh, reach others. So you will learn others. That, uh, in fact, is enrich and uh, aid up more and uh, uh, bring them more unto yourself. And so, therefore, it's a really nice thing to do. It should be fearful and uh, uh, concerned. So I think it's an open mind, being open-minded and being more courageous and, uh, and, and to others and think more broadly and more wisely and should have uh, be able to come, overcome the fears. And so, yeah, the, all of you said a wonderful thing and, and so amazing speech and thank you very much. And I would like to say, oh, the, so let me just to introduce yourself. I didn't introduce myself at the beginning. So I studied in the Labrong and the, uh, the Center of Learning and uh, the Monastical University. And, uh, so, yeah, and that's the, but back to the main topic is that uh, the religious harmony and uh, or friendship uh, and uh, cooperation. Uh, and uh, so, and uh, if you do not really uh, try to and uh, uh, reduce or uh, reduce the gap and and, uh, and between and uh, the uh, overcome differences, then that difference will remain the same, and you will remain and uh, unknown about others, and uh, so you will st uh, stick on to your own tradition, and you will become one-sided uh, and be a very narrow-minded. But if you open up and uh, look in others uh, the, through the uh, the sacred outlook and with the pure uh, vision or pure perception, and then naturally, and uh, uh, you can see others' quality. And uh, my lama, this great root lama, is a the uh, the Jingwei Pinto. And uh, as you know, he is really the master of a non-denominational and uh, a master. And uh, so um, because of him and in, in, in his uh, practice, and, he, the, uh, he, and I, I not only uh, learned and also deeply understood the, how important to, and, uh, to practice uh, uh, religion, uh, my tradition based on the non-sectarian uh, approach. And so, and, and uh, uh, yeah, this kind of uh, uh, contacts or and, uh, uh, reach out uh, will bring the closeness and uh, us together, and we will uh, overcome the things which we don't know, and will from an unknown become known, and uh, we will cover overcome the misunderstanding and misperceptions, uh, and we will become get familiar with each other, and uh, so this way we can naturally we reach the religious harmonies. That's what I believe.
Uh, I would like to say a few words. Uh, may I uh, let me? Uh, in general, uh, so I think it's important to understand the nature of uh, the non-sectarianism. And uh, so, so the the nature of the uh, non-sectarianism and uh, been de uh, defined by many masters before. Uh, and uh, so. And uh, so the uh, masters, uh, the high-level masters, uh, they talk about uh, the non-sectarianism, and then they they have uh, uh, the understanding and their uh, appreciation is, uh, uh, and uh, they will have to understand you know, how they define it, uh, and uh, so every religion has its own uh, uniqueness, uh, and. Uh, so, and uh, so you do have to have uh, your own philosophical view and uh, your own system, and uh, at the same time, uh, so how you can understand and uh, see others' uniqueness and others' uh, uh, great uh, qualities, and uh, so and those unique qualities and it's you from where you have to track all the way back and to its historical and uh, origin and um, then then you will see and uh, so there even if you see some contradictories uh, and uh, but that, that differences uh, or uh, contradictory and uh, you will see, oh, this is a very important moment, a point to uh, gain a fresh understanding and uh, learning. And uh, for example, and uh, so we have all the, this uh, material world, and uh, uh, but uh, all the material world and, and, uh, uh, essentially constitutes uh, uh, constitutes by the four elements. Uh, Right, like uh, fire and uh, uh, some are dry in nature. Uh, in nature, some are wet in dry, in nature. Right, and uh, all of them are in, so uh, it's uh, essentially a contradictory, and then they are in a disharmony. Kind of, they're not, they they are they have their own uniqueness, and uh, um, but uh, they're working together, and uh, they forms uh, the material world. So similarly, uh, each religion has a spiritual lineage and has their own thing. And uh, so, so, so we have to know that uh, uh, to be uh, um, to be biased. That is definitely uh, unapproachable, and it should be and uh, rejected all the time. So unbiased, it should be bi not be biased at all. But uh, uh, we have to be unbiased. And uh, so, for example. For example, like the uh, the practitioners of uh, the Mahamudra, and uh, so if they understand that they, uh, so what is really the uh, essence of the Mahamudra, they can understand and uh, enjoy or appreciate better. Thank you. Uh, so Nathaniel Wanji Rinpoche, as he said, and uh, before we didn't see each other, uh, but uh, last time when you were in India, so we met each other. We ended, uh, we met in person and we talked to each other. Yeah. And uh, so I myself uh, before, and uh, and uh, I and I was in when I was in uh, Nepal, and uh, the, the, the monastery where I live, not far from there. And uh, there is a monastery, and uh, so, uh, so I went to the monastery, uh, the Bum monastery's uh, uh, library, and I uh, opened the book and uh, read the book, and then I got a feeling, say, oh wow, and uh, so the the theory view and uh, the ritual practice, and uh, all of them are amazing. So I really had a wonderful feeling about the Bun tradition. But uh, I never be able to really had the opportunity until we met last time and uh, meet in person and uh, form this relationship, a close relationship. Um, 
So yeah, this is a, a way you know we and, and we build up uh, the relationship and the closeness to each other. Um, so we should uh, share our philosoph different philosophical view and ritual and practice uh, as well as uh, the and our unique uh, uh, quali other qualities. And uh, so we all are here. And, and uh, so we are the folks that today and then like a non-sectarian and uh, Nizam and the future, I think uh, whatever we can do, uh, we should do and uh, we must try. And uh, but we should not just remain the, and uh, at this conversational level or webinar this is the, uh, uh, level, but uh, rather we should put into the practice. Uh, and I think it is very important. Thank you, Rinpoche. Uh, yes, uh, you're right. Uh, and uh, the non-secretarialism or non uh, unbiased approach, um, and this is important. And uh, so again, and we have to pay attention to other tradition, and uh, through the by pay attention or through the uh, uh, giving a closer attention, and then and we will develop the sacred look. And uh, it is my sincere wish we will to meet each other again, and again, and having this kind of uh, conversation and uh, meetings together again uh, more and more in the future, and. Uh, so, like I talked to and uh, the Soga Rinpoche before, so I asked her, what is the next? And uh, so, and uh, he asked her, and uh, so before I finish this one, I already think about next, and uh, uh, in general, it's kind of odd. But anyway, and uh, I'm already thinking about uh, what to do and how to spend, uh, make a time. And so I'm 100% dedicated. Uh, and uh, so whoever come to America and uh, the, here my center uh, the, uh, is in Virginia and uh, please come and visit to me and uh, I, you have my invitations uh, and um, so if you have uh, anything in particular and uh, please uh, say uh, make your uh, uh, comments otherwise we we'll slowly end. And so, in general, and uh, all the Rinpoche's and your experiences are shared and uh, great. Uh, uh, I myself, in the, when I was 29, I read the Bumbu's uh, stages to path to the Enlightenment to Lamrim. Uh, and uh, I find that uh, the, the way that you find the three jewels, uh, and uh, other than the Dharma, and they use the word of a bone, I don't see any really differences, and then uh, I find uh, well, and uh, so whatever you say, the uh, bone or not, uh, there are spiritual. Uh, it's essentially the spiritual teaching, and uh, so I had a really good feeling about it in the tradition. Um, so we all have to look and check and study others, uh, uh, the path and the foundation or ground and the view. So, and that's what I want to say, thank you. And uh, so I would like to thank you from the bottom of my heart to all of you, whoever commented today and uh, to my today's Facebook Live. And thank you so much, uh, best wishes to all of you, Testily.